Hey everyone, this is Jasmine and welcome back for more Cyberpunk 2077. Okay, so for today's episode, I am going to do the pickup. So let's do this. Oh uh, wait, before that, let me check out my skills. I guess I have two attribute points available that I can upgrade. One of these, um, maybe I'll go for this. Cool determines your resilience. Resilience, uh, I guess so. <laughs> Composure and effectiveness in operating from stealth. Each level of cool will increase critical damage by 2%, increase all resistances by 1%, increase stealth damage by 10%. Wow. Reduce the speed at which enemies detect you in stealth by... Oh, okay. Maybe I want to go for more of this. Technical ability represents your technical know-how. It allows you to unlock doors. And use type weapons. Each increase in level will increase your armor. Oh, okay. Now my, I'll go for this first. <laughs> I hope I didn't upgrade wrong one. I guess I need to use up my perk points as well. Let's go and check it out. Health slowly gen regenerates during combat. Increases carry capacity by 60. Um, shotguns and light machine guns deal 3 more 3% more damage. Okay, this is cool. We have a lot of skills to upgrade, but maybe I'll upgrade that next time. Yes, we also have all these crouching tiger and hidden dragon. <laughs> okay, let's not spend so much time right here. Let's do this. Go to the gate of all foods. We have a job to do. Go on, let them know we're here. Uh, call? Okay. <clears throat> Don't know you. Uh, oh, here. Wanna talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Yes. Main room. We've been waiting. Okay. Oopsie. Is this okay? Yeah, cozy place. Why am I crouching? Could use a okay. Few plants, though. <laughs> Read message. Oh, yeah. That's message. They look damn but most well collectively, prepared. first will come the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. Okay. Ooh, items, tech, tech. Oh, what's this? Ooh, components, this is useful. Tech. I need components to craft items. Tech. 
Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a gel factory. Uh, Steve. Yeah, the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Did you hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. Called him special. Okay, watch these. Uh... Okay, 1,000 beats a second. I couldn't believe my eyes. For a moment, I thought Jessica had changed them out for 40 Kiroshis while I was asleep. But no, that wouldn't have been like her. I blink again, no change that I saw them clear as day. The open flaps of Jason's chrome skull. I saw the electronic grain that, will, uh, that up until now had been hidden by perfect imitation scene skin. The son of future tech CEO, the son of my damn dreams Jason, he was an android shit. I sat there stuck with a dumb expression on my face and Jason stepped back with one of his own. I couldn't help but wonder now, were those beautiful blue eyes of his the same that had pierced my soul? Were they merely a mimicry controlled by some emo org algorithm? Had there never been anything real behind them all those times? Not once. Alex, uh, it's not what you think. He pleaded with a strangely authentic note of panic in his voice. And I wanted to believe him. I really did. Hmm. Well, clearly it hasn't been. I replied in equal parts anxious and bitter. Me and my rotten luck, the first and last guy I fought for, and he turns out to be a goddamn motherboard on legs. <laughs> motherboard on legs, okay. No, that's not. Jason suddenly broke off and smiled awkwardly. Wait, did you, did you say 4-4? Four, four? My cardio implant began to beat more and more quickly. My face flushed. Had I been wrong? Could this body of bolts, wires, and plastic really contain whatever is left of the real Jason Cadales, if his father was being, was able to design a synthetic heart for me, maybe he could do the same for his son's brain. The question is why? Okay, what an interesting story. Let's go move on. Uh, what's this? Okay. This place is really dark. Good thing this is not a horror game. Then I don't need to be afraid about. Ooh, I got a new clothes. Nice. Oh, is this like. Oh, another message. Can cyber psychosis be cured? Can cyber psychosis be cured? Opinions on that question are divided. Only a few years ago, so-called brain dance therapy was used across the entire uh, country on a mass scale with the aim of bringing the sick back from the point of no return. The patient would be placed on a special chair and connected to a device that would deactivate all implants and electrodes would be attached, inducing the patient into a coma-like brain dance session. This was then followed up by medicine, psychosurgery, and the aeration therapy. The overall treatment was intended to sever all the patient's neural connections and tie them back together so that cyber psycho could return to society once the therapy was concluded. No symptoms of cyberpsychosis were detected, as well as the patient's formerly personality. But don't worry. Nowadays, other methods are used. At least, that's what they tell us. Okay. Another interesting story. Oh, what's this? Wow, this is long. Okay, if you guys want to read this, uh, you can always pause, yeah? Because I am running out of time. 
Uh, Oke. Okay. <laughs> uh, take this. This in fact. Okay, let's move. Oh, a new pants. I got a lot of um I guess I have two new clothes. One is the t-shirt, the singlet, one is that pants. Yeah. Okay. Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel's better. My favorite. Oh, okay. That's a staircase here. This is so full. I shouldn't have just climbed up from here. But at least it's working. Okay, I guess I've read this. Oh, wait. What's that? I got a uh, new boots, I think. Ooh, so many gadgets. Get in the elevator, fucking sheep. Stay cool. They're just trying to spook us. Okay, I am busy looking around, looking for items. Oh, okay. Future meat. Not only are all foods products uh, healthy and nutritious, they will feed our future. Soon, all foods will launch a pilot line of new products to complement the. Beef brand, easy beef, easy beef brand. This series of meat products will be based on flatworm cultures, which have been found to significantly to, uh, help increase metabolism, slow weight gain, and cleanse the intestinal tract. We hope the flatworm initiative will usher in all foods later successful generation of meat products. Okay. Very high tech meat bag. Ah. Oh, what's this? Yes, I'm coming. <laughs> There's a lot of people here. You. You coming? Yes, I'm coming. Alright. Go. Alright, you chill, V. Remember, we're on their turf. Yes, stay calm. So, what do you want? Uh, where's Royce? Here to see Royce. We got biz to transact. Mr. Royce is busy just now. You will deal with me. You got a bot. Model MT0 D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah. You talk to me. Name's Dum Dum. <laughs> Now cat, planning. Excuse me. Okay, let's sit down and talk business with them. Ugly robot. <laughs> well, shit. Go 
goes for you too. I'll stand. <laughs> this so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. See your ass down for a planet bullet in your skull. Okay. Jack, sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... <laughs> that that to just calm me well, down. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Don't want to have any troubles with these ugly robots. You. Line up. Take a hit. Ah. Uh, okay. Better. Is this trucks? Shit. Now we can talk. I regret that. I shouldn't take that. Here I'll show you if that's go. a drug or what. <laughs> Flathead. Model MT0 D12. Shall we to me? Militech's not gonna come looking for it. Okay, show it to Need me. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. This ugly and robot does a lot of things. Fully integrated. Ooh, I can't see tube. that. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm Could lose your lunch. Okay. So what you think? Uh, it, it have to do. What's this? Travel diesel? Oh, I can't choose this. Okay, this yep. then. We'll take it. Three, sure. Yeah. He just plugged that into his That's head secret. to give a power supply it. to that. <laughs> Doggy robot. Oh, well, what the I don't hell? See any fucking brick around here, do you? Really expect me to pay twice? Fuck brick, let's I'm cut a new deal. Fuck brick then. Let's cut a new deal. Now that's good business sense. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Uh. Okay. Relax. Got him right here. Just like that! Without that in the fucking eye! <laughs> I need the ball. Oh, want it or not? Want it or not? I got places to be. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Yes. Dexter Deshaun. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? Maybe a dead? No, he's alive, well, and kicking. No choice, I have to regard. choose this. <laughs> so I'm gonna consider my offer now. This is the only option. <laughs> Pay, uh, shoot. You're short, sir. Okay. Heads on this. I don't want to shoot. Okay, better don't cause any trouble. <laughs> <sighs> hey, Flathead's good gear. It'll do the trick for you, whatever the trick is. That was kind of intense. Shit! Shit, shit, shit! Can't stop it, Vector! What? A few moments later.
Hollow weapons allow you to control the direction of bullets. Uh, okay. Cut off. Grab the gear. Bottom control shard. Quick. Okay. I gotta find a way out of here. Got the set. Bot and controller. Hey, let's go. so you can make uh, okay It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved meat. <laughs> There's no other way. Okay, screw on the production line to clear passage. allow you to charge uh, okay Get off me! 
my coat on this! Oh, okay. He's my jacket.
Okay, this bitch, I should have killed him earlier. speech now
Okay, never mind. I'll go the other way around. Watch out. Shit. No marker. Objectives is very weird because the track location is I have to go into the middle, but Royce is right there. He is just staring at that side. How do I go to that middle? For sure, I can't do these objectives to sneak past Royce. Is that orange thing hacking? Maybe I can go there. if I stand in the middle Okay, can I do this again? 
Try to run away from there, it's so dangerous. I should have killed this guy earlier. Come on! Again! Again! Another one. Yes, this ten. Die, Maggot! Just receive an iconic item along with a set of crafting specs. You can use this to craft better quality versions of this item. When a new version of an iconic item is crafted, the original item is destroyed. Iconic items can also be upgraded just like regular weapons or pieces of clothing. Upgrading improves their levels and stats, ensuring they remain useful as you progress through the game. Okay. Bitch. Come on, V. Let's get out of here. Yes. Oh. Open. In the deck. We got those things buzzing around everywhere. Yes. Oh, it's That's night okay. time now. We can talk there. Bet you didn't expect to see me here. You know, I like the way you operate. Maybe you'd do some more work for us. Yeah, I keep my word. When I say something, I do it. Keep my word. Mm-hmm. Me too. Heard one of the flatheads is missing. Must have fallen off the truck along the way. Guess Militech will never find it. Pleasure doing business. Secure the area. All right. Time so. we were on our way, Mamita. 
talk to Jackie. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. Good work, Jack. Thanks, Jack. Solid as ever. <laughs> hey, yeah, you too, but, uh... Hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, I want to make sure, you know. We're good together. I like how we do things. I do too, V. Thank I do you. too. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. And then I say we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. Ay luego, V. Call Dex. Okay, let me take a look at my mission. Oh, I still have these. Okay, 6 a.m. Well, maybe I'll go to Lizzie's bar for the next episode. Right now, I guess I'll call. How things looking, Miss V? Oh, okay. He has already Got called me. <laughs> and how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the military game? Sure, of course there was trouble. I <laughs> couldn't give in two shits that you break it shit. Stop me. How'd you get him on board? You use the corpo woman? Met with Stout, managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch for Maelstrom. One thing Stout forgot to mention. Chip was carrying a virus. Oldest corpo trick in the book. I assume Royce was less than understanding. Virus attacked their systems, scorched a handful of Maelstromers. I took care of the rest. You got some balls, Miss V. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Park will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. All right. Hey, go to Lizzie's bar. Okay, everyone. Today's episode is really, really, really toughest one for me to do. I almost give up and... I yeah I almost gave up but I just keep on try 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 and try and finally we made it uh, okay okay guys I know for today's episode I fight really very bad I died a lot of times and I hope you guys don't mind because this is my first playthrough which I never played before uh, by my own I only play this for you guys okay so if you guys enjoy my episode for today don't forget to subscribe for more videos and don't forget to give me a like and tell me what you think about this game okay and all right so i will see you on the next episode bye guys <laughs>